the complaint came to light during a recent Farmers Information Sharing Day held at Omagalanga in Oshikuku constituency of the Omsati region. Addressing the gathering, Namibia National Farmers Union President Jason Mvula said, subsistence farmers are finding the going tough owing it to the prolonged drought, which saw them fork out thousands of dollars to purchase fodder and other supplements. Jason said some crop farmers were severely affected by this year's flash floods. Farmers are facing many challenges on a daily basis. Number one, crop farmers who realized a bumper harvest are not having a reliable market for their produce. In the price we are getting now of $5 per kg of, of mahangu, there is no a single penny of profit, profit included. I can state that categorically clear. But several reasons were given to that, but we need to address this issue and have it resolved. Mvula also expressed his disappointment with the prolonged closure of the Oshakati abattoir, which was the only formal market for farmers. The union leader revealed that livestock farmers do not have markets for their animals after Mitko abandoned the Oshakati abattoir. The farmers are now forced to sell to locals at prices that are not market-related. From the part of NNFU, we are in engaging relevant stakeholders and partners, including government, to find an, an amicable solution to end the deplorable situation uh, in that regard and once, once and for all. As of recent, uh, government has pronounced itself clearly through a cabinet directive uh, that says a growth at home strategy must be put into, uh, into action, which compels all government institutions to buy all locally produced available in order to avail markets to the local producers. The government has pronounced itself through a cabinet directive clearly that says a growth at home strategy must be out into action. Farmers also had an opportunity to showcase their products and services at the event.